YouTube, YouTube, what it is. It's your boy, Black Prince the Barber. Hey, man, look, check this out. I just got something in the mail today. Stick around. Let's see what it is. You know what I'm saying? Because, hey, I'm excited to see this as well as you are. So stick around, so let's find out what it is. Okay, guys. Okay, guys. Okay, guys. I know you guys are as excited as I am. But uh, something just came in the mail today. We're going to check it out. I mean, sounds heavy. I don't know what it is, but I'm just going to check it out and see what it is. One, one moment. Let me get a knife. All right, YouTube. I don't know what it is. It just came in the mail. I am very excited. Seriously, though. This is my first time opening this. Because I haven't ordered nothing in a long time. Okay. Uh, uh, as you guys can notice, I've never opened it. I'm just first time opening this, baby. Okay, here's the big reveal. Oh, my God. Wow. Okay. Wow, guys, guys, guys. Throw the box away. I don't need that anymore. Wow, throw the plastic away. I don't need the plastic no more. <laughs> Guys, look, check this out. Oh my God, the Gold FX. Oh man, these the FX 787G. These the one that had a metal lithium outline and trimmer, man. These are the metal. Oh my God, Beverly's Pro, man. Wow. I like this. I like the case that it come in. You know, the case look pretty nice, man. Oh my God, look at there. wanted a pair of these. Uh, let's just see what's coming you know, come with the of course you get the trimmers. Well, they're pretty lightweight. They're not as heavy as the and T outliners. Do they come zero gap already? I'm pretty sure they do. I'm pretty sure they no they don't. You probably have to preset them. Set them yourself. Wow that is nice man. Gold FX. FX. Wow. Okay, the first one to do, let's see what else in the box. I'm excited, man. I don't need this anymore. Okay, there's nothing but the the guide to how to use them, I guess, or how to set the blades or whatever. I don't know. Oh, my, okay, you have a sticker. I guess you can stick them on the side of your clippers or whatever. It, it's nice. Oh, Babylon's Pro Barbarology. That's nice there, man. That's nice. I don't know if I'm in frame or not, so just bear with me. Oh yeah, this is just the actual manual for how to use the book, uh, the trimmers itself. Okay, that's nice. That's real nice there, man. Wow, I can't wait to start using them joints. I mean, these are nice, man. Look at that. Look how nice they are. Shiny. Oh my, they are going to be some number one hitters. But like I said before, I'm pretty sure I want to compare these to the T Andes T outliners and the GTX as well. Because hey, I'm a big fan of Andes T outliners. You know, you know my lines be crispy, you know what I'm saying? So hey, we're gonna change the whole world with this. Wow. I'm just so excited, man. Let all let's see what all comes with this. Okay, got a couple of items. Excuse me. Okay, this is the charger for the okay. This is the charger for the Babylon Pro. Okay, yeah. And I'm going to uh, do a sound test too to see the difference in the sounds of these and the uh, angles as well. Okay, let's see what else we have. Okay, we have a key. We have a blade setter. I'm going to open these up. Open these up. Okay, these are the blade setters right here. Okay, with a screwdriver and everything. That's nice, man. Wow. So I'm taking it that you put this on the bottom of this somehow, and you adjust the blade to your, you know, to your settings or whatever. So that'll be my guess. Well, actually, I'm sorry. It goes this way. I'm sorry. It goes this way, and you probably have to adjust the blade some type of way, you know. But don't worry, I'll, I'll figure that out in the near future. Let's see what else. Okay, a blade guard. Okay, just in case your guard, your, you don't want to just set your blades up and you can just have a guard to protect it. 
So that's nice. That's pretty much that's good. Okay, in case you want to move your whole blade, here's the screwdriver as well. Like a little key to it. Looks like a little key. And of course you got the oil and the blade brush, you know. Keep everything, you know, copacetic, legit clean. But guys, just give me one moment. Um, I want to do a sound test. I don't know if the clippers are actually charged right now. But just give me one moment. I'm going to go grab my Andes T-outliners. And we're going to do a sound test. One moment. Actually, you guys, I want to do a sound test with the Andes T-outliners, the Wild Hero, and the Baptist Pro Gold Skeleton FX. I want to just do a sound test and see which one sounds, you know, like it's more hittable or more on precision, more on sight when I, you know, because I'm more of a listener more so than anything when I cut hair because I want to make sure the hair line is, you know what I'm saying, crunching. I, bro, I'm ready for crunch time when it comes to, you know, cutting hair, lining hair. So let, just give me one moment, let me plug these up and I'll be with you guys. Like I said, I don't know if the right there are charged up, but I want to just still yeah, see. All right, first, first off, I want to do a sound test with the Andes. Let me take the tape off of here. I like the way they put the tape on here to make sure everything is secured. Okay, take these off. My first time turning them on, I don't know if they charged up or not. But here's the Andes T outliners. Let, let's just hear the difference. Let me get a little closer to the camera. Now guys, I'm gonna do a sound test at the same time. Let me know which one of the clippers, the trims that sounds louder that you hear, okay? Babylon's Pro FX Skeleton or the Andes T outliners. Same time. Well, actually, these are a little louder. I guess because they're brand new. Because you know when you buy stuff fresh out the box, it, it's hitting. So uh, I mean, just loud. But I've been having these for over four years, so of course these are not going to be as loud as these because, like I said, over four years of cutting, man, you know, they, they, the motor tends to wear down a little bit. So I'm pretty sure in the near future, this one right here will uh, wear down as well. But I'm going to keep this some high maintenance and everything. Oh, one more extra thing. Um, I'm going to uh, test the other ones too. I forgot to mention to you guys, this is a little clip on here too, so in case you want to hang them up, you know, after you get through cutting, but I'm not really no hanging up type of person when I, you know, when I'm doing my clippers. Okay, now let's try the sound test with the Wild Heroes versus the Babylon's Pro FX Skeleton. I'm going to turn these on, well, these on first. Okay, All right. they sound good. Run pretty smooth. Same time. Wow, these are much louder. These are much louder. I, I had, like I said, I had my clippers. I said I probably had these about three years. And the other ones about four years. But I still keep the maintenance up and everything. But later on in my tutorials, you guys will see me use these more than I use the other ones. Well, I might use the other one just to, you know, ball off and, you know, everything else. But these right here are more of a um, starting guideline, you know, when you make the first initial guideline. So this would be the first starting guideline of haircutting. Wow. This is very beautiful, man. This is nice. But guys, I really appreciate. Okay, you can set them up too. See? Wow, nice. That's beautiful. That's gorgeous, man. That's gorgeous. But guys, I want you guys to pick up a pair of these, man. These are beautiful, magnificent. I like the blade setter, man. You don't have to take the blade off to set the blade. Like for these, you have to take the screws out and everything and readjust and all of that right there. 
but the blade setter is just actually on the outside of the blade of the steel blade and you can adjust from the wow from these two screws right here man that's all it takes i mean wow so uh guys that will conclude my video well i mean i'm just standing about it but guys that concludes my video make sure you guys be watching out for my tutorials man I'm, hey, i got some good stuff coming up you know what i'm saying we're gonna be a beast with this watch out for my tutorials come and learn how to cut it Type of fade, all type of hair, anything, all type of uh, you know, coarse hair. It don't matter, man. We're gonna cut some hair with these jokers right here, but um, wow, um, uh, yeah. But make sure you hit that subscribe button and turn on post notifications, man, because you know, I will start dropping tutorials every week. But now, next week, we might have something else coming. If not next week, might be the week after, depending on the COVID thing, because you know, a lot of uh trucks and everything running late ups fedex all of that they running late so if not this week or next week it will be the week after most definitely i'm still having any box reviews hey like i said make sure you guys hit that subscribe button turn on post notifications it's your boy black prince the barber <laughs> and i'm out of here i really love these guys peace